Okay, I'm back. I've done a little bit of experimentation. I've had to reset the game like three times. But uh, I've been going through. Adept is not worth leveling. I'm going to say that now. It's got maybe one or two very useful skills, like increasing your sort of physical defense and evasion on your uh, main character and reducing RP cost at a very, very expensive SP cost. Um, so if you want to go, all right, I want my spellcaster to cast all day, use that, but it uses 50 SP, so I should be using that on summons. There's no reason to really use that. So Adept's not worth leveling, don't bother. Um, I feel a bit bad about all the bloody levels I've spent in it already. Also, Healer. Healer is full of dead levels. If you're not, if you don't know what that is, that's essentially a level up that gives you nothing. Um, it, I've knocked up um, Rajet's um, healer level up to 19 as a backup healer. After level 12, no more new skills and barely any stat boost. I mean, look at that as a subclass. It's barely adding anything. It's adding quite a lot of maximum MP. But all the other stats are pathetic. It's it's really not wasn't worth leveling up. It's utter trash after level twelve. Once you've got rays, don't bother leveling it up anymore. So there you go. There's one for the meta game. Um, I've kept lying at you know level twenty knight as a subclass. So I've not really looked at the skills you get from that so far. But we go protection. Guard goes up. Great sword skill. Shield impact's nice. Crush just feels a bit pathetic. That ironclad is too short-lived for that much SP. It should be free at most for to just two turns, unless that like really maxes out your physical defense. Um, again, another great sword skill. Again, it's a shame the other guy can't learn um, the, the knight subclass. This would actually be useful because it synergizes with the weapons he already uses. I mean, there's nothing stopping me changing to Kai Sticks or something like that, rather than great sword for him. But yeah, protection's nice as it raises resistances rather than just physical defense and stuff and five turns is uh, a reasonable cost still a little expensive i might as well just use neji's um raises physical defenses for five turns which only costs four i think i feel like some of the costs are not balanced yet that needs tweaking and effective as a guard i'm not impressed i'm really not impressed with knight I mean, compared to, like, the primary class it's of uh, Blade Master, it feels like it has nothing really going for it. So, let's give you Brigand just for a little bit of oomph. A bit of bonus HP. I'm just going to get that uh, Electromancer class again. Just gotta quickly run across the world. Assemble pieces. doesn't feel particularly thrilled about the solo element type classes because well depending on what you come across those can be very useless and I just realized I need to go back to this, the area again at the start I'm just gonna pop back and look at the message board sorry I didn't do this whilst I was in here I had intended to but I got distracted no new requests okay now we run across and go to the Dan Academy and we get the plot moving I'm really annoyed with myself today. I've just made too many mistakes and wasted far too much time. Especially since uh, 
you no longer have the very easy and uh, useful uh, YouTube uh, video clip editing. It's like a job that would take me 15 minutes, now takes me hours because rendering times on my sodding uh, software. Gandalf. And that's a wonderful reference to the beginning of The Hobbit. I love the fact they're using the animated films thing for the sprite. So many people forget that exists. It was very, um, well, it was very good, even if it was only uh, the very first part of uh, The Lord of the Rings. Any difference what people are saying? Not really. It's a really huge facility for um, not many recruits. Okay, Chun-Li, I'm guessing Chris Redfield. There's like a dozen different elf characters that could be. Green hair, pointy ears is all I've got to work on. Um, and the knight is just too nondescript. I wouldn't really say Chris Redfield really strikes me the mentor type. That man is a little too unhinged. Oh my god, he's annoying already. Gandalf makes a logical teacher, 
So does Dumbledore actually, but... Come on, Gandalf wasn't that good. Alright, and, and before you get angry with me, I'll explain why. One, he's technically like an angel, and he doesn't actually use his magic. He hardly ever uses magic in the Lord of the Rings setting. In fact, the Lord of the Rings setting is a pretty low magic fantasy setting. Um, and he mostly, because of his oaths and like non-interference sort of uh, policy, he has to make the a lot of like basically cat's paws other people to do his work for him. He, he's not that amazing as a wizard because he's got all these restraints on him. I mean, he'd make a wonderful um, kind of uh, philosophy teacher and uh, how to manipulate people teacher, but actual spell casting? His is divine power. Ooh, is that a random quest? Ultra class boosts. A hundred what? Round spell book thing. I have no clue what that is yet. Oh god, how You know, I'm gonna save before this because I think because of our high levels, this might actually be very difficult. Okay, let's give this a try. We don't want to knock her out. We want to do status effects. Oh, that's an adorable sprite. Does reduced um, physical defense count as a status effect? Yeah, what the hell. Lowest resistance. No idea. You know, I'm just gonna guard with you. Black magic, it's all you know. Reduce magic defense. That's a status element, isn't it? I need something that only does the burn damage without actually knocking her out. And burn's dangerous. 50 damage, poison or dizzy, that should do. That 50% is not helping. Alright, let's try it again. I hope this class is a success. Burning through my SP rather quickly.
inter it's an interesting variation. Okay, excellent. That was impressive and not listed in the um, in the rewards for that. That was completely different to the reward, reward, the rewards listed. Now you're just reading my temperament. What if she was holding that? <laughs> I'm so tempted by love life. You know what? God! Alright, that unlocks that for me. Okay. I wish I'd taken notes on the uh, Love Life one already, but uh, canonly he ends up with the detective girl. I'm very tempted to follow canon. <laughs> oh. What? That's referencing his source games, I'm sure.
Oh, so he's in a universe where the death games never happen. More rewards! Bloody hell, Monty Hall as we go, here we come. And with that, I think that's this um, video completed. I mean, it's been fun so far. That was really interesting. Um, the five potential romances. Oh god, that's going to make my head spin for trying to figure out that and not screwing up and selecting all of them by accident.